Gabby, how you doing? Welcome to Be Gabby. Now, this is a session that you are to understand that it's always good to be you. You can't be anyone else because everyone else is tainted. So, with that, make sure you take good care of yourself. Now, from my title, you can see that, yes, it is a breath door haul. So, let me get started because I don't like long introductions. All right, the first item that I have is this beautiful sheer turtleneck short sleeve shirt. I really like it. Um, it's really nice. Um, it was $2.99. It zips up or zips. Uh, this is the back. It has a small zipper in the back. You turn it around. And this is the front. The reason why I like this blouse because it's very nice, very feminine. And it's what I'm going to be about this summer because I'm looking for things that are very soft, pretty, um, feminine, and um, fashionable. So the thing that I like about this blouse the most is because it is so sheer. It is sexy sheer. I really like it. I have a bracelet. I'm showing you how sheer it is. Just by passing this bra uh, bracelet, silver bra bracelet, through the material, that you can actually see in areas where it is sheer. And I think that that is just so sexy. So that's why I got it. The next thing I got was um, this nice kind of summer shirt with a plunging v-neck in the, in the front. Um, it is sleeveless along with a pair of white pants, which I thought would be a great combination this summer and possibly throw a jacket over it. I thought this was really nice. It will look really uh, nice over under a jacket or with a skirt. So I'm looking forward to this combination or breaking up the set and uh, mixing it with something else. Now, feminine sheer is what I'm going to be all about this summer. I want to be soft. I want to be cute. I want to be sexy. I want to be feminine. So that's my look for the summer. And this summer, this is what I'm going to be looking for and be, um, and this is what I'm going to be wearing. I'm going to be wearing soft, subtle uh, material, very free flowing, very airy, very loose fitting, uh, feminine type blouses and skirts this summer because it's going to bring out the pretty in me. And that's what I'm all about this summer is bringing out the pretty in me and so should you. So um, I got this also from the thrift store. I really like it with the bell sleeve. The sheer scallopy bottom. It is double, it is sheared with an underlay underneath. It also has a hint of red beads uh, throughout the blouse. It ties at the front, which is also a plunging V, which will make uh, the breast area, which I am an A-shape, uh, look smaller. It will give the neck a sexy look, and I'm going to feel real pretty and material flowing like this because I'm hoping it's going to be hot, and this is what you're going to be needing to wear <laughs> during those hot summer nights or those warm summer evenings. How about that? Again, with the sheerness, this is what I'm going to be rocking. This is a tunic. It is in a uh, fuchsia color, trimmed in uh, blue. Trimmed in blue. I really like this. It's long, like a tunic like. It is split on both sides. It also has the um, soft sleeves here. These are straight sleeves, but it's got the slit in the sleeves. Kind of uh, oriental like and I think that this is going to be really cute uh, with um, a pair of pants a pair of pants and um, a straight leg jeans of some sort and a pair of 
nice sexy high heels. I think that's going to look really, really nice. Now, this is the first for me that I'm about to show you. And this is an actual, uh, what, they, what we call a back out. I love the, the details on this back out. Now, as, like I said, it's a first for me. I've never owned a back out shirt, but you know, when my age, you sometimes you, if you've been a little bit conservative through your younger years, as you get older, you get a little bit more daring. And so I figured I'd step out a little bit and get this back out, which I love it. It has the uh, bronze study studding on the uh, lapel of the chest area. And it rests right on the breastplate here. And then right at the waistline, it has this beautiful same type of design at the waistline area, which I thought was just downright gorgeous. So again, I am stepping out. There's the pack out there. I am stepping out and I'm going to be a little bit daring this summer. So Okay, I will do a outfit of the day when I do wear this, once I figure out what I'm going to wear with it. Now, 70s and 60s are all the rage because the 60s are back with the it's early 70s with the bell bottoms and the flower child kind of look. And so is the uh, macrame, macrame tops and macrame purses that have come back on the scene. So I found this at the thrift store, which I thought was really cute. It is a macrame tank top in a olive green with turquoise flowers and some wooden beading in the breast area here. There are some small beads there, as you can see, but I'm not going to wear this alone. I paired, I'm going to pair it with this Eddie, um, I'm sorry, um, Ed Hardy tank top that I found, brand spanking new at the thrift store. Everything that I purchased was $2.99. There really wasn't any deals. The deal is they give you a percentage off. You know how my uh, uh, store rolls. It gives you 15, 20, and 25% off of your total bill, depending on you if you spend 15 and up. So that's the way that works. So I got that. I really, really enjoyed myself. Now, I was looking at my sister, Kay Harris. I don't know the numbers behind her name, but my sister on YouTube, Kay Harris, was into getting new, uh, in search of new dresses, uh, you know, to wear very nice dresses, and she found some, too. So I was went on a search for some dresses, too, and I lucked up and found this Empire Waist Turquoise Plunging B. Uh, um, sleeveless uh, dress, brand new from old uh, let me see, Faded Glory. It stretches. This is so nice. I've got the perfect summer shoes for this blouse. I would probably uh, pair it with maybe a tank top or a wife beater or husband beater, <laughs> wife beater or a tank top or, or uh, some kind of underlay on, uh, on it or by itself or pair it with a sweater or a blouse and I can, you know, make it a working outfit that I can wear to work on a really nice warm summer day, but it's also great for a nice warm summer evening. And as far as my clothes is concerned, um, this is my, my dog, my last item here, I was like, Oh my goodness, I could not believe this um, dress was on the rack. It's in the t-shirt material, same as the turquoise one in that same flimsy, loose-fitting, breezy uh, uh, material. Oh. And I fell in love. It is a plunging V for a nice, warm summer evening for a uh, maybe a yard party or a festival, or um, just to, you know, 
hang around, you can dress it up or dress it down. I really like this dress. I love the brown. It's going to look fantastic with the shoes that I have in mind, especially those bronze colored sandals with the rhinestones and the matching purse that I got from AJ right back in the wintertime. Mm -hmm. See, that's why you go ahead and get your accessories that you like just in case you run across something to go with it. Don't worry, you don't have an outfit to go with a pair of shoes. You eventually will find one. So when I saw that, this, that's what I, the first thing I had in mind was those shoes with the bronze purse. See, now speaking of purses, I found this. This is a crazy horse. This is a crazy horse, as you can see there. Leopard purse. I really like this. I thought it was an excellent, excellent, I thought it was an excellent condition. Um, it was uh, $4.99 for this purse. Um, I snatched it up really quick. Like I said, I had for those purses, and I get that out the way as soon as I can. And then um, you could resist it. I like that I can wear it uh, closer to my body here. I like that it has... Um, Velcro right here, so I have easy access. I like purses with easy access. I don't like too many purses that's co too complicated to get in. It takes up too much time. And then with me trying to pay for things and get out of a person's way that's behind me, I tend to just throw things everywhere and don't keep it organized. So I like to be able to kind of control um, how I set my purse up. So I don't like flipping and flipping and squeezing and all that other stuff. Unless I pop, you know, if I really, really like the purse, then I'll do it. But if I'm going some to, to a store or if I'm going shopping, I need to be able to get to my stuff really quick and not have to fuss with it. So this came come in handy. Another thing that I'm carrying at this present time, which I thought was a very nice, I like it because it stepped up my, um, my carrying and then step it up and add it to my carry. I love this. This was so nice. I could not pass it up. I thought that this was fantastic. I love the leather handles on it. It does not have a name to it, but the make of it, the make of it, the way it's made, how sturdy it is, the line of it, making it look very, you know, sophisticated like. Um, I can carry my computer, my laptop in here. I really, really like it, and I can throw it over my shoulder along with my purse and still have room and be comfortable with um, carrying it. It's not bulky. It's not pulling me down. Um, it's not catching on anything, and I can also carry my, um, it'll also fit over, you know, a coat or a jacket, which gives me plenty of room, so I really, really like that. All right, people, that is my time. I hope y'all like my little haul. I uh, liked showing it to you once again. This is Cynthia from Be Gabby. Be good at being you. You guys take care and bless all my stuff. Thank you and have a great day. Bye-bye.